the 65 corridor taking us to 465 that on and off ramp system. The northbound lanes right here is where we do have some issues as far as the lane restrictions go and it's more so that ramp from 65 northbound on to 465 eastbound. So we'll continue to monitor that stretch right here just to make sure that doesn't cause any more issues or backups this morning. That all should reopen by about 6 o'clock this morning so we'll keep an eye on it. Do also want to take you up to the north side of town where we had some big delays along 465 westbound. Right now all of those lanes have reopened but we're still awaiting the ramp to reopen from US 31 south on to 465 westbound. We'll let you know when that does reopen this morning guys. Five. This was, of course, that stretch of 465 South, where we did have lane restrictions due to some construction, as well as that ramp from 465 Southbound onto Pendleton Pike that was closed this weekend for some construction. Everything has cleared. All lanes are back open, and that live picture there shows us that traffic is still relatively light in that zone, so everything's looking good over on the east side this morning. Do quickly want to take you down to the south side. This is going to be 65 Northbound, approaching I-465. Uh, that ramp is still partially blocked due to some ongoing overnight construction there. So that should clear momentarily. As you see, traffic still light here, and we're not seeing any backups due to those lane restrictions. So at least that's a good thing on the south side of town. We'll keep you posted when that reopens. And of course, if we see any new accidents five on the south side of town. So these are the northbound lanes. As you approach that 465 junction, we do have some lane restrictions on that ramp to 465 eastbound. So do want you to be prepared for that. Although as we watch that live camera, not looking like it's causing much of a delay, at least at this point, we'll let you know. Now, this is some good news over on the east side of town. That weekend construction that was down the 465 southbound stretch between uh, State Road 56 and Pendleton Pike. That uh, actually reopened late last night, so that's some good news. All travel lanes are back open, and as far as any delays go up the east side of town, 465, both northbound and southbound. At the since that has since reopened uh, late last night, that reopened, so all lanes back open as you approach uh, that Harding Street on and off ramp system. Also want to take you to the south side of town, 65 northbound. We've been monitoring this for a potential delay watching to see if they clear that ramp from 65 northbound to 465 eastbound. Uh, that should be clearing here within the next 10 minutes, so some good news there. We've also been watching the east side. This is where we had overnight, uh, or I should say over the weekend construction on 465 southbound in between 56th Street and Pendleton Pike. This is that Pendleton Pike exit where that ramp has since reopened. And we are not seeing any delays on the east side as of right now. So that's some good news. But we'll keep you posted if we do see any issues for your morning commute. We'll be But that is happening in between two of our cameras. So I'm not exactly sure what that issue is. But this is the camera closest to this at 65 and 71st Street. We'll continue to monitor that, let you know if there is an alternate route that might be needed due to that. Guys. 65 northbound these lanes right here all of those travel lanes and that ramp from uh, 65 northbound on the 465 eastbound has since reopened so uh, that should not cause any issues at this point in the morning so that's some good news also want to show you what it looks like over on the east side had some major construction here over the weekend. 465 southbound had several lanes closed in between 56th Street and Pendleton Pike. That has reopened. Also up US 31 southbound on the 465 on the north side of town. All of those lanes have reopened as well. Approaching 865, uh, that's where we typically see a lot of brake lights and some stop and go traffic. And that's slowly what we're starting to see building north of 86th Street. Uh, that's 465 northbound as you approach the northwest side. Also over on the East side had some weekend construction that has since reopened. So that is some good news that those lanes are back open on 465 South. But again, busy stretch approach that Keystone Avenue intersection uh, that was said to have blocked a couple of travel lanes on Benford Boulevard southbound right before you get to Keystone Avenue. Again, not a major backup developing around that. So hopefully that does clear soon. We'll continue to monitor traffic flow around that incident and let you know when it does clear. Otherwise, out on on the east side, starting to see traffic flow picking up. This is 65 near 71st Street, and then a busy morning out at 465 closer to Pendleton Pike. But the good news is that weekend construction did wrap up. That does mean all of these travel lanes are back open on 465 southbound between Pendleton Pike and 56th Street.